In this video, we unbox a twin pack of smart plugs. Alexa, let's roll. It's Da Vinci time. Okay, so it's unboxing time of the Hyloton twin pack of smart plugs. Uh, we've got the usual details on the side here, which is the uh, voltage information, which is AC 110 to 240 volts. Uh, we've got the power rating, which again is important. So that's 2.3 kilowatts or 2,300 watts in this case. It's got the various other bits and pieces on there, but the important bit as well is um, the 2.4 gig Wi-Fi. So whatever router you're using this or wherever you're using this, it needs to have that network available for this plug to work. And it's got support for Alexa. Google Home and IFTTT. So what we'll do is we'll get in the uh, pack and see what we've got in here. So we've got a little thank you note there from the manufacturers for Hyloton. We've got, um, I must say it's quite a small um, instruction manual there, but that's actually quite clear. So judging by the uh, scan on here, the QR code on here, it looks like it uses a Smart Life app, which is actually what I use for my other plugs. It's actually quite a good app. Um, it gives all the details there as well as setting up with, by the looks of it, setting up with Alexa as well. So that's actually really useful information there to get these plugs going. So let's have a look at them. As you can see, they're uh, very well packaged. Let's see if I'm so well packaged I can't get it out. So let's have a look at these. So the design is actually a very smooth uh, curved design. And this is the uh, type of plug which actually runs under the uh, plug socket was some of them run over and some of them are just uh, flush with the plug. So uh, let's have a look. This is looks like it's ABS plastic, so it's quite robust. It's got information on the back there again about input voltage as well, and uh, the model number on this, which is three one five. And again, that's I think that's covered in these instructions here. So it tells you the different ratings. You might not be able to see that, but it tells you the different ratings within this which each model actually is capable of. So that's that. Right, setup time. I've plugged both of the smart plugs into uh, an extension lead here, as you can see. They are both now flashing uh, either side, which means they need to be flashing about twice a second so that I can set it up in the Smart Life app. Two plugs in the middle are actually my filming lights, which I usually use to test uh, smart plugs when I set them up. So um, in a minute, I'm just going to set these up and then I'm going to plug these into these and we're going to see how they work. Okay, I've now set up these plugs in the Smart Life app. This is Studio Light 1 and this is Studio Light 2. If you want to find out more about how setting up uh, smart plugs in the Smart Life app, there is actually a video being suggested in the top corner right now. So have a look at that one. It's another smart plug review that I've done on this channel. So. What we're going to do is we're going to take out one of these lights now. So this taking out Studio Light 2, we're going to plug that into our smart plug. And then we're just going to see how that works in the app itself. So that works perfectly as you can see. So what we'll do is we'll leave that and then we'll get ready to do Studio Light 1. And then what we'll do is we'll just show you the uh, manual uh, plug or switch on here, which works perfectly as well. So now it's time to leave that one on, otherwise you won't be able to see me, and try Studio Light 1. So that's plugged in nicely there, so we we'll move over back to the app, the Smart Life app that is, and as you can see, that works perfectly. So that is app setup complete. So now it's time to try out the voice assistant. Right, now it's time to test out the voice assistant. So the easiest way I've found to do this is you've already set these plugs up in the Smart Life app. So all you need to do is go into the Google Home app or the Alexa app and literally just link your accounts to Smart Life. It's quite easy to do and all it does is just need your password and your email address that you registered for this particular app. And then basically Alexa will then discover the uh, details of all your extra plugs that you've added as well as Google Home will as well. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do a little test. So we're going to switch some lights off. So OK Google, switch off Studio Light 2. Alright, turning off Studio Light 2. OK Google, switch off Studio Light 1. Sure, turning off Studio Light 1. Alexa, turn on Studio Light 1. Alexa, turn on Studio Light 2. 
and there we have a perfectly run test. So as the test shows, this works perfectly on both, uh, both Alexa and on uh, Google. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and uh, see if we can get one to switch the other on and one to switch the other off. So let's see if we can get this to work. Alexa, it's time. Okay, Google, switch off Studio Light One. Okay, turning off Studio Light One. Alexa, turn on Studio Light One. So the voice assistants are about to take over the world. All the links are in the description below. Please add some comments on what you would like to see on our channel. Alexa, we are finished. We hope you liked our video. Please give a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell icon. Stay tuned to Dad Vinci.